killer starting on. But I don't remember if that's locked. Backpack. Let's see, oxygen three. Where is oxygen three? It's not there. It's not there. Yeah, see, because there's the advanced crafting station. We need that. Oh, and that's 175. Oh, blue skies when you unlock that. I did not realize that. That's interesting. Okay, let's slap down a veg tube as tight as possible there. Did we get any actual... I remember seeing a chest with stuff, but I don't think I picked it up. Okay, so let's do terraforming. Okay, terraforming screen. Scroll. Okay. Progress. Wait, what? Craft a progress screen? I don't have a progress screen. Um... There it is. Heat. Oh, of course it's heat. Wait, what do I have that's generating heat? Energy. Uh, uh, pressure. Oh, drills too produce heat. It's not much, but they do produce it. Oh, wow. A heater one is only 3, 0.3. A drill two is 0.1. So three drill twos is the equivalent of one heater one. I did not realize that. That's actually really useful. All right, dump you. Grab two more. Magnesium, titanium. All right. I have two aluminum, which is wonderful. Okay, what do I need now? We need the backpack. Is the backpack available here? It is. Two aluminum. Of course it is. Um, aluminum... Titanium silicon. Titanium silicon. One thing that would be really cool for the developers to add to this game would be one of those um, craft from storages options where like you can be building here and it pulls resources from here so you don't have to have them in your inventory. As long as you have them, you should go click, 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 click. That would be super nice. A lot of other games do that after their player base begs them to. Okay, that's more aluminum. We are out of aluminum now. Okay, grab those. Okay, I officially need to do a journey. Um, the problem is I don't know where. Do we head that way first? Okay, let's, let's do this. Let's grab... Oh gosh, is that really where I have to go next? I just, I'm thinking of wrecks that I know of that are nearby, and there aren't many. Now mind you, some of them are good. Some of them are some of the best wrecks in the game, but they are far from here. Oh, I just realized I have two seed Shangas, which I need to put into effect. Veg tube twos. Um, there isn't really a particular reason to grab the rest of that yet the deconstructor is not for a long time so alrighty let's see what we got here we have titanium uranium ooh pull the lermas out and throw in the shangas see here's one of those things where it's like lermas that's one of the moments where lermas aren't quite as good or whatever, or they're not as important. Uh, they're good when you start them, but then as soon as you get anything else, you swap them out. Mainly, it's just the things that do require it, require it, and there's no substitution. That's the hard part. Okay, so we're going to go like this. We're going to drop two silicon, and we're just going to straight up grab two of those right now. And... Dump the one. Okay. So... I'm thinking about where there are wrecks that I can go to, and there's two main answers. One is I go that way, up over the dune, to the, um, and I want I don't know if it's right right there. Let's find out. So the, the two main locations to go to for me this early in the game is either the crater, 
the um, meteor crater or to the white glowy area but the white glowy area is really far away I think we're gonna do this one first let's head this way and see what we can find there should be a handful of chests out here not a ton but a handful I want to say that rock there has a gold chest on top yeah that one has a gold chest on top and I think there's a blue chest like behind it or something but yeah this is definitely going to be an area where once we unlock the beacons I'm going to have to put beacons literally everywhere because it's going to be so hard to navigate Oh, that was a bit of a loading lag. Hello. I was just minding my whoa, minding my own business, and I started lagging. Yeah. Hello. Come on, game. What the heck? Yeah. See, here's the crater. Yeah. If you choose to start crater, you literally start. I think it's right over there on the ridge. So we're not that far from home. Like home's right around that corner. Um. Shoot. Let's do this. We're going to go right here. And we're going to slap this down. Like this. Because here's the issue. Once you go down in the dust, it's very easy to get lost. And not like... I don't know how to describe it. Like, you get lost, but not in, like, a hopeless way. It's more of a, you blink and you turn around and you're at, at the, you're on the far side instead of this side. And you're like, whoops, I got turned around. And now I have no oxygen and my base is there when I'm there. You know, that's the issue. Come on. Seriously, guys? I need three iron and there's none. What the heck, man? These pairs are dead. What happened, guys? There's one. One. Any more? No. I think that's one right there. There it is. Oh, there's two. Perfect. Yeah, because the plan now is there's two bases in this region here. There's two wrecks. But I'm pretty sure the one in the dust is pitiful. I don't think there's anything there like at all. Or darn near nothing. So we'll find out. We'll find out shortly, though. Because, yeah, if I remember right, the one in the basin in the bottom is basically empty, but the one up on the ridge is great. So, real quick here, let's triangulate. Here we go. Oh, we're going to need to do this, too. Iron. Ooh, the lag with that dust. Two titanium. There it is. Yeah, see, this is what we missed in the other playthrough, is this meteor. If you get here too late, this meteor is gone. Okay, living compartment. Door. Um, storage. I don't have a flashlight. That's okay, there's nothing down here. Um, blah, blah, blah. Found a way to build somewhere else. Oxygen. Space food. Kind of dark, but I can... Ooh. How do I... The angle to click those is kind of, is kind of annoying. Okay, do I have what I need now? Yes, I have what I need to make a thingy. Okay. Alright, so this is basically where we're going to get our iridium from. Because the cave, the iridium cave is, I'm pretty sure, blocked off with ice from the other side now. Which is really annoying. And so now... Oof. 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 That's actually good. Why is it good? Dang it. Okay. I'll have to come back and grab that. I have a full inventory, but I have everything in my inventory that I need to build my next building, which has to go up over here on this ridge for the other place. I also realized I still don't have a torch, so I'm going to be doing this in the dark, unless I can find the resources I need to build a torch. Come on, jump, 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 come on. We can do it. Oof. 
How does anyone live without? Oh gosh. How much further up do I have to go? I think I'm going up too far. Uh-oh. Well, I found it. Not near me, but I found it. Okay. It's over there. I went too far. Oh. Oh, yeah, there's the rock. I was like, I'm seeing glimpses of something, but... Yeah, so this is the base we're looking for right here. Come on. Come on, game. There we go. Okay, and then can I throw down... Yes, one of these. Dump everything. Ooh. Solar twos. Awesome. Dump all that. Um, if I remember right, this one is kind of dark. So let's do... Um, let's do a little work here before we go down. I need an iron. I don't have an iron, but I need an iron. Oh boy, straight down. Don't like it. Don't like it at all, but here we go. Iron. Ooh, iridium. Um, iron, silicon, magnesium. Is there another iron nearby? There is. Perfect. Let's grab an ice and a titanium while we're at it. And another iron. Another iron. Yeah, see, this is the iridium. We're going to need to come back down here and grab all the goodies. Where's our building? Uh oh. I don't see it on the way back up, so this is going to be annoying. Jump, my boy, jump. Um, error. My space bar's like, what are you doing to me? There it is. Yeah, see, this is that getting lost in the in the dust part. Okay. We need one of these. And then we need one of these. And I need a torch, which is a mag extra magnesium. I don't have what I need. Lovely. I was going to say, if I don't get what I need down here, then there's something wrong. So that led us down to here. Oh, this is the big one, isn't it? Oh, I forgot. This is the big one. There's the starts of a jetpack that they're trying to repair there. I've also never been here when it's this dusty. It is so dusty down here. It's like a bajillion iron, and that's all I found. Okay, that's a, a dedicated iridium. Ooh, baby, look at all that. Okay. Quick, back out. I have a full inventory. And it is so dusty down here. Okay. Alright, gentlemen. Do we have better storage yet? No. Wait, but do we have... Wait, you're going to tell me for everything... What the heck was that? That was so weird. I'm trying to play stuff, and it was like, yeah, nah, you can't. You're going to rename this instead. I'm like, what? I might need that soon. Okay, so we're going to take a left. Take a right. Take a left. Take a right. Take a right. Go straight. Yep, go straight. Take a left. These goodies. Grab that. Okay, that's the down to the bedroom. K 
Okay, yeah, see, this is one of those... Ooh. This is one of those, there's only so many wrecks nearby, but there's a couple of the good ones nearby. And this is one of the good ones. The other really, so there's two, I would say two of these underground wrecks that are the best. This is one, and then the other one is the white one, way over by the volcano. I would say that's probably the other best one. Oof. Oh, man. Holy smokes. Um, yeah. Just go ahead and do that now. Because there's so much stuff down there. Yeah, like... Oh my gosh. Just like everything I have is full. Alright, down, down. I also only have a tier 3 backpack, so that doesn't help. Okay, so take a right, take a left, take a right, take a right, go straight. Don't turn that way. This way we just did. This way is where we were. Okay. And honestly, the amount of aluminum that we're finding. Okay, random pulsar quartz. Love it. The fact that I can't tear those apart. That's one thing I wish the devs would change in this game. I wish they would make it that anything like this that you found, you could take apart. Like 100% of it. Like that screen, these pieces here, the chair, the desk, every, the bed, everything. I wish everything that you found could be deconstructed. I'm assuming they don't do it because they don't want you to get too much too fast. Because then you could just strip down an entire, you know, thingy and be like, hey, hey, I now have a bajillion resources and I didn't do anything. You know, I raided one wreck and I'm already super far ahead. But to a degree, I think it would still be fun. I still don't have a silicon, I just realized. Like, silicon is kind of an issue. Got one, okay. Let's throw down blueprints right there. Decode. Compass, that'll help a bit. What do I need for a compass? <laughs> Another silicon. Um, one more silicon, lovely. Shall we start with the, lo the young, the, the lovely? Shall we start with the lovely? Yes, dear, I think we should. Darling, that didn't make any sense. Have you been drinking today? What? No. I'm not even quoting a show. I'm just losing my mind. Oh. That's the wrong way. That's the way we're, we come out when we're done. This way, and this way, and then this way, and then this way. And then we go, and go, and go, and go, and go, and go, and go, until we go here. And then we come in here, and everything is done. Sweet. So we come back up, and we go this way. Take a right, deconstruct, deconstruct. Oh, this was, I think that maze right at the start where we came in at. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is like the last of it. One fake wall there. Holy cow, that's a lot of goodies. My inventory is very nearly full. That's a tree seed. Oh snap, that's like an actual tree seed. Not like a potential tree seed, it is a tree seed. All right. All right. One of these, as I say, one of these should be full and then, or empty, and then that one should be empty too. Okay, back down. Back down, back down. We're gonna head straight this time and then take a right. And yeah. And with this, we are officially done, right? Cause I can't take apart the Rex yet. Yeah. I am confused that this uh, person made it so, like, big and windy. Like, I understand it's, like, t to make it more fun to explore, per se. But, um, as someone who builds their own base, that's a little excessive. Oh my gosh, there's so much iron here. Oof. Okay, I have the Tier 3 backpack. Tier 2 oxygen is as good as I can get. I already have the agility, so that's useful. Alright, so again, we're going to grab this in order of importance. The aluminum is worth its weight in gold, so are the lermas. The iridium and uranium. Um, I 
I don't think those are necessary important to bring right now. It is good to know they're here, though. See, Pulsar is really good, but I don't need it right now. Like, I can't do anything with it for ages. Okay. Was there any more aluminum I missed? I don't think so. So at this point, we'll go uranium. I think I can grab all my seeds, honestly. I think that's something I can definitely do now. Because there's basically nothing else here to grab. That, I guess. Meh. Okay. This wreck is done. There's... Oh! I thought I saw a glimpse. No, it's that rock. Okay, so I've got a lot of goodies here that I need to somehow get back to my base. The good thing is most of what I found in that wreck I didn't necessarily need. Like, this is all good stuff. Um, but even the stuff on my inventory is not, like, super critical. Um, no, it's fine. It's fine. What I have is fine. Okay, now I gotta remember how to get the heck out of here. Okay, yeah, so here's this one, which means my exit point's right about there. So we're actually gonna go get some oxygen. Just double check the chest in here. Oh, there's nothing in the chest in here. Oh, it's because that's right, this is the one that had nothing in it. Right. Okay, ooh, chest. Jumping, 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 come on. Oh my gosh. Do you know how terrifying it is to go up to that? Last time I went up to a rock like that, it pushed me, uh, it dumped me into the bottom of the map and I almost died. And then I had to parkour really hard to get out. Wow, we're only 50 minutes in. Wow, good grief. Come on, keep jumping. Yeah, I'm noticing there's a lot of that. I feel like I'm like glitching and looking through things. But to be fair, I'm never jumping. I'm usually on a jetpack, so. Come on, there we go. Yeah, so that's the initial bit there. There's also a cave over there with iridium and then another cave over there that leads into the blue area. But again, we need heat to do that. Okay, now returning home. Hey, we can see home from here. I can see my house from here. There is still that chest up there and then another chest under there too. So there's there's all kinds of goodies out here. Um, I'm definitely going to be pushing hard to get to the jetpack. But I want to say jetpack is locked behind the one, the KTI thing. I think it's locked behind the 175 TI. ATI versus TI. Does that mean we're at 29 out of 175? Is that what that means? I think so. How much iridium did I get? Three. I'm bringing back only three. That means I'm going to have to drop these at the base and then basically go straight back and load up on just iridium and then come home. Because I'm going to need so much to get started. On the flip side, I did bring... Oh, I didn't. Just kidding. I had that 200 seed and I didn't bring it home with me. That's okay. Okay, what did we get here? <laughs> Pardon me, <laughs> I got none of those. Okay. Um. Let's dump all the seeds and trees like that. Okay, and then we'll dump all the food and the aluminum. And then... One, two, one, two, three, four. Whoop. There we go. I officially need room for stuff like that. One, two, three. One, two, three. I don't know if I have the power for this. We're going to find out very quickly. I do. Okay. I just wasn't sure. I'm like, this is either going to be just fine or it's going to kill me. Okay, now these take a lot of aluminum. How much aluminum did I bring home? Oof. This storage is murder. But we have not unlocked the next one up yet, so we're just kind of stuck with it. 
Okay, we're going to bring in oxygen. We're going to bring one of those. Did I not have any food? Oh, I do, but there's... Oh. Yeah, okay. Okay, back up we go. We need to do like a full load of iridium and then bring it home. That's next on the dossier. Interesting that in this scenario, the iridium starter is the is the wreck or the um the meteor. The meteor crater is the iridium source. Like that's all you got. All you have iridium wise is that. I wanna say there's a couple other Audi bits. Oh, my other my other super alloy source is going to be the volcano. Because the volcano gives obsidian and super. So that'll be good. I'll at least have something out that way to look forward to here in a bit. How are we doing? Okay, we're about an hour in. All these goodies here, but I don't have time. I have what's the word? Greater prey? Greater quarry? Something like that. All right. And I do have a couple of buildings in that mess that I'm going down into, so that shouldn't be as big of an issue either. Yeah. Okay. Oof. I definitely feel the lag going down into this more, though. We got our progress screen. That's good. That's on our list of things that it's going to yell at me for. Now... The one issue is I don't have my jetpack to get on top because there's a bunch of iridium rods on top. So we're going to just have to parkour and see what we can get from it. Yeah, like right off the bat, it's like... Ugh. Come on, let me up. Oof. I sincerely hope I don't get stuck doing this. Because that's going to really blow... Okay. Indoor ladder. Those alerts are always so loud. Oh yeah, oh there we go, there we go, there we go. Rod. Another one. Rod. Oh gosh. I can see him, but can I reach him? Come on. Come on. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that's that's good. Provided I don't get stuck in here. There we go. There's another rod. Oxygen's bad. Run. Oh, wow. Look at that. We ran straight out to it. Yeah, look at that. Look how many rods we got off that. Very good. Okay. Dump, dump. Let's go in for another round. Yeah, basically I just want as much iridium as possible before I head back. What the frick? A super alloy? What on earth? Oh, that's another thing. If the devs ever watch this, another thing to add. Um, so in games like Subnautica, they have a visibility feature. And um, basically what it is, is it's kind of like a, like a minor cheat or a minor thingy. It's like a minor cheat, but it's extremely helpful. And uh, basically what it is, is, it makes it so when you look at resources... Like, you know how when you look at it, it gets the white border around it? Um, basically, the um, visibility thing would turn that on all the time. So every time you see one of these, it would have the white border around it. Or a yellow border around it, or something. It's just a visibility feature that games like that have started putting in. And it's very, very generous. It's very kind, because it makes it so that um, things that are just kind of... Like, those two would be glowing white the iridium rods in here would be glowing white, you know, 
things that just make it so when you're looking for things, looking for things and trying to loot things, it's easier to see. Um, a very, very um, 